Welcome to f- fucking tech. Today we're going to look at uh, well, we're going to update the case on a fairly uh, I don't know if it's unknown, but I mean it's a fairly uh, understated uh, Casio watch, which is which is the the AQ S eight ten W. With the module, what's the module? 5208. Now, for the price, this is an outstanding Casio watch. For maybe 40 bucks US, 60 bucks Canadian, brand new, you can get this G Shock looking, which is not a G Shock, analog watch with the needles, and just about every other function. That you could have in like uh, the GWM 5610. You have solar power, five alarms. Well, let's go through it. You have a uh, waterproof uh, 100 meters. So you got the battery level because it uh, uses solar. Then you have world time. Okay. London 20. So, so we get the you know, world time alarms. You got five alarms. Okay, the, the 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 hourly signal. Then you have timer. All right. You have top stopwatch. Okay. And then you go back to here. I mean, this is an outstanding watch for the price. Solar waterproof, just like stopwatch, world time, uh, chronograph. I got this one for 40 bucks used at the uh, pawn shop. Now, uh, you can see here that the face, there's some lettering missing. It's supposed to say tough solar over here and it's supposed to say illuminator on the bottom here. So because this is a two tone, it's already two tone white and black. We're going to flip it to a white case. See how that goes and there's already a white model of this that exists but this is like a third party stuff uh, and the bracelet is a little bit more flexible than this hard stuff it's not that much different I thought it was I thought, okay I thought it was harder than it than it is <laughs> so let's let's update this and now I got a kit uh, from eBay or something uh, so we got white bracelet White plastic face. This is not rubber like the um, the 5610. This is actually hard plastic. Now, over time, I'm expecting the uh, the text to uh, rub off just like it did on the original case here. Now, there's a tool come come comes with it for the screws here to, do, to undo the screws to undo the case. So I got this tool that comes with it, and I have uh, this uh, spring bar tool with new screws and new spring bars so that's good so let's put this aside and let's okay let's get the spring bar tool let's start with the bracelets let's get that off come on down you're the next tool on the fucking tech all right well let's undo these uh, spring bars it shouldn't be too hard I'm expecting it to be a little bit hard put them back because there is just like the 5610 which is a pain a real pain okay why is it so <laughs> this is odd never had this much okay there we go so now this watch I got it it was fairly clean so there's a little bit of dirt here with the bracelets but I don't care about them because we're not gonna use them they're coming off man whoops okay that just flew off perfect so that's gone all right so we're got the uh, the core but we still have the case so let's get the screwdriver for the, the face the case. Mm-hmm. 
right? Last one. There we go. We got the four screws out. We're gonna move those out out of the way. We're gonna not gonna use them anymore. So let's see. How do we pry this apart? Okay, for wow. There's a lot of dirt. All right, so we'll clean this up and uh, we'll be back. All right, now it's all cleaned up. It's very nice. It wasn't dirty in the back, but uh, see now it's very clean. So let's put on the face, the case, the white case. It's pretty good. Okay, let's put that on there with the little screws. Get the screws bouncing around. Okay. Got the screw tool. Yes. Yes. Ah, wow. It's not very. Okay. Got the starter. I'll we'll put the other ones in and then I'll screw them all down. looking a little bit better than just the, the black the black case without the lettering I mean the lettering does give it some contrast in this and uh, let's keep on. all right okay, I'm not trying to scratch it more. Okay, so we got that, so we got this, so we got Okay, we got this. Alright, it's pretty good. Yes! Alright, now let's this is the swearing part. Okay, so we need Okay, this is the top, so we're going to put the buckle on the top side, we're going to put the spring bar in the buckle, in the, uh, whoop, wow, that just went straight to the floor, <laughs> wow, okay, now I'm losing my tools, straight to the floor, okay, see, so we have like a contrast here, it's white, white with the black back, so, uh, yeah, interesting. Okay. Oh, crap. Okay, so these ones are super loose, unlike the 5610, which was super tight. Oh. Okay, spring bar tool. Let's put this in there. Come on in. No. The 5610 had me swearing. Trying to put this back together because it does suck. Okay. Try this. Wow. It's already in there. Okay. All right. Not bad. Okay. Okay, we're Okay, I need to get the I need to find the spring board spring board that went on the floor. And it's gone. <laughs> okay, I got a spare. <laughs> they provided 3. Okay. So I got another one in the bag. All right. Now, now to clean this up, all I used was just water and a toothbrush. Very easy. 
Okay. Oh, oh, nope, nope, nope. It's gonna come out. Okay, where is it? Wow, that's in. Oh, wow. Okay, that was... Nope, that failed. Okay. <laughs> Almost got it. We're close, we're close, we're close. Let's try this. Okay. Okay, let's try this side. Okay, this is easier like this. This is a... It's not a great bracelet for it. Spring bars. It's not very good. All right, that seems to be in there. Okay, that was fairly easy. Wow, okay. Woohoo! This is nice. I mean, come on. Analog, all the features, solar, waterproof. I mean, this is an outstanding watch for what it is, for the price. I mean, come on, and it's super light, too. It's ridiculous light. It's lighter than probably all the other watches that I have here. So I got a little, uh, oop, nope, 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 this came out again. Ah, crap. Okay, doesn't matter. I'll figure that out after, so you get the idea. That's what it looks like with a uh, little contrast buckle there. So uh, here we go. Let's... Uh, so then like this, so this is, this is the uh, Casio AQS 812, uh, no, 810, <laughs> Casio AQS 810, very nice, very nice little uplift there, all right, but wait, there's more, <laughs> well, plastic straps are not really fantastic, usually, so, I also have these uh, strap adapters that I got so we can actually put in some straps and what I'm going to put in here is a white NATO strap that I got that I took off one of my other products. It's another video coming soon. So I got one done here. I got one strap adapter put in. So all that's needed is to take the spring bar out. It's... What's going on? <laughs> Come on, man. Okay, here we go. Whoa. Okay, spring bar. So I got the two plastic bracelets off. I'm gonna put those over here. I'm gonna use a spring bar here. And we're gonna put in the other strap adapter. Now these adapters have... Oh, these ones don't have the holes. They don't have the uh, holes to put in uh, spring bars. Because they're actually quite soft, they're rubber. Okay, so I'm going to put the spring bar in here. All right, we're going to try to put that in there. Now, let's see how this goes. The first one went in pretty easy. Wow, that seems pretty in there. That went pretty easy. Wow, impressive. Okay. So now we got the core watch with two black strap adapters and we're gonna put it in the strap so we're gonna have a nice little contrast of the black and white even more. Put it in there, yes. All right. So that's on the strap. Okay. 
Then we're going to have the other end of the needle strap under like this. Like that. So now the watch is on the strap. Yes. Now tell me this old $40 watch, used watch from the pawn shop is not looking great. I mean, come on. It's pretty good. <laughs> it's pretty good. It's pretty good. So this strap is like uh, 22 bucks on Amazon. So uh, adapters, uh, I don't recall. They're not, they're not that, that expensive on eBay. So I mean, for an old watch, you can revamp it with some nice parts for cheap so with the parts and everything this watch used and everything it's even even new you can buy this watch and these parts for below a hundred bucks i mean amazing for a nice g-shock looking uh solar waterproof world time alarm timer stopwatch analog I mean, come on, this is, this is pretty damn good. So, here you go. Stop it! That's on this Fucking tech.com.